Let's go ahead and hop into it. Let's see. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted to Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, Wizardry as a fifth year student. Term begins on 1st of September. Preliminary supplies have been collected for you and will accompany you in your journey to the castle. As you may be aware, the decree for the reasonable restriction of underage sorcery prohibits the use of magic by the use of. 17. However, due to your unique circumstances, the ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor El Eleazar Feig. Ain't gonna lie, they could have chose a better name for that thing. Okay. Oh, so we make a person. Hold on. I heard that they had no black people on here. This is pretty black to me. Ain't gonna lie, that's pretty black to me. I heard that they was. That's pretty black to me. That's pretty black to me. I heard that they ain't had no black people. That's pretty black to me. I ain't gonna lie. That ain't gonna lie. That's pretty decent. That's pretty decent. I ain't gonna even, I don't even know if I gotta change that too much. Let me see the faces. Nah, I ain't. Uh, uh, Let me know, Sawyer. Which one looks the most like me, man? Which one? Let me know, man. Like, I don't know. I don't think any of these shits look like me. I ain't gonna lie. I'm gonna go here. I'm gonna go here. What's up with the freckles, though? How'd I get the freckles gone? Ooh, that nigga just went incredibly nerdy. Nah, 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 I'm good. I'm good on that. I'm good on the. I'm good on the glasses. I can't tell. I can't tell this nigga white or black. I can't lie. I'm gonna just go there. Be safe. Let's see how many of them they got. I guess this will be one. Is this one? Low key. Niggas just don't go to the barbershop like ever. I guess this will be another one. Is this one? Mm, don't know what the hell that is. I guess this will be another one. I guess this will be another one. I think this would be the closest I'm going with. That's definitely ain't one. That's definitely ain't one. I guess this would be the only other one. I guess this would be one. That could be one. This would be one. I think I got some thick ass dreads. I think I'm going with this though. Yeah, I think I'm going with this. Get a more lighter nigga. Okay, 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 okay. Let's get a lighter nigga then. Yeah, Damn. Yeah, what if I don't want, like, any freckles? Oh, okay. what this one look like then? Oh, hold on. I do got moles, though. Hold on. Hold on. Nigga, get this shit off my screen. Nah, it's more like this one. Yeah, it's more like this one. Complexion. Okay. Let's see. I don't even know. I don't even know what this is. Like, what is this even doing right here? I, I really don't. I really don't understand what that, that even just did, to be honest with you. Yeah, 
I'm good on that one. Let me see. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Nah. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be cons. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Why is that? That was quite something. What is this peach? Pitch. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. All the other ones seem a little weird. All right. What difficulty are we going with? Focus on story, light gameplay challenge, normal, or the hardest difficulty. A demanding gameplay. I think we're going to go with the hardest one. What should my name be? What should my name be? I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Definitely got to be Fitz. Got to be Fitz. What should the last name be? What should the last? I'm going to go with like a Dumbledore or some shit like that. That's the only thing I remember. I don't even know. How oh, here we go. They got it right there for me. I think that's how we're going to start that joint. I don't even know what the difference. I'm going to keep it a being. Um... Oh, just click this. You have you have the name you enter has restricted words. Okay. Can't be Dumbledore. Which is evil? Now let me look this shit up. Now let me look this shit up. Hogwarts difference between Wizard and witch. Because it ain't gonna lie. I'm an evil motherfucker. <laughs> Facts. Wizard and witch is the wizard world's equivalent to a man and woman. See, this nigga wanted to troll me. I knew I knew he was trying to troll. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go wizard. What should my last name be? I like that. I like that. I like that. I like I like that a lot. That's a good one. That's a good one. He kind of stepping though. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the term begins. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theatergoers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eleazar. Mm -hmm. Of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We had a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. I wonder what I would sound like if I had a, like a, a accent, rocks. you know? What do you look at? What the hell? That's not, that's just regular, huh? Okay. Yeah, like... What the hell?
before you left for Scotland. <laughs> Just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? A new student. New? Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eliazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eliazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume... That she had to get rid of it quickly. To keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. H how did you wait? We did the hell. The hell? the hell? Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Okay. Oh, George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would, but stay close. We've no idea who created this port key, or why. Take us. 
farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you the think... The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right, and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, there's the path down below. This way. But sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Man, if you don't come on, bro, like, what is going on? Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent! You can come to select the active target. Some players prefer to select targets and move the avatar with the thumbstick by disabling the current camera. a bit rougher than I'd expected. Oh, so he like auto climb stuff. Okay. Ah, up there. Yeah. We're close now, it's just ahead. Steady yourself! Tough. I ain't gonna lie, he kind of crazy. Almost there. I like the lock on system though. I got unlimited though. Someone have built this here. I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. Mm, that's kind of hard, ain't gonna lie. Minimap shows your surroundings. Okay, kind of like a regular minimap. Okay. Oh, A. 
Can't just spam buttons, you gotta hold it. Okay, I like that. Professor, this statue. This may have been his home. Enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! I'm curious, I'm gonna look up Harry Potter. Wow. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. It's a lot of moaning going on, bro. Like, is there is there like finna be a a, a good finish uh, ending to this joint? Like, what's going on? I have to walk up to it and press X. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Hello? <clears throat> Damn, his nail's crazy. How many vaults are there in Great Gods? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As you we know, strap in, in is just, we just sit. You see now Man, hell no. Are private entrances to the bank common at Green Gods? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You want to take a breath? A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle it. Bro, we not even strapped in, today. man. This is crazy. Vote 
Vault number. Vault 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. What's his purpose for being here at that point? All I have to do is say Vault 12 and I'm on my way, my nigga? Like, damn. Last time this vault was accessed, a goblin has been stationed. This game kind of smooth. I ain't gonna lie. Years. In that time, no one has visited Vault Twelve until today. Vault Twelve. Thank you for your help. It's not at all what I expected of this game, I ain't gonna lie. We were already straight to it. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor? That was certainly unexpected. Let me think. I felt like he was gonna close there that must shit, be man. Something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio. Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Ah, uh, let's see. Steady your wand. Guided along the symbol's path to learn the spell. Press the corresponding input when prompted to accelerate your wands. This nigga said, this nigga said, why you make your nigga look like Drake? I swear I didn't mean to do that. That nigga told me to make him lighter. I made him lighter and that shit just happened to be like that. I forgot that nigga Drake had braids. Okay, okay. What the fuck? That looked that's that was easier than it looked. Or harder than it looked. I'm gonna be honest. Revelio. There, I saw something. I kind of think I understand why this game ain't multiplayer though. Cause they're gonna have like probably puzzle. You're gonna have to probably do puzzles for like certain spells. A door. Well, that's a start. And it has the same mark. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Let's get it going. DJ Academics will fuck this shit out of my player. We all know why. This is no ordinary vault. And did you tell me you I make my dude light skin just because of that though, bro? Yeah, that's kind of crazy. Earn our way out. Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end I can't say. That nigga don't look shit Stay like close. Drake though. I ain't gonna lie. There will be no I don't know what that nigga thing is. Not out of Gringotts. Alright, nigga, I'm trying to stay close to you. Don't be just I turning on the dime. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos. What happened? 
When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. They trying to hoop. Okay. Okay, they trying to hoop. I like that. I ain't gonna lie. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Strong as shit. That nigga far as hell swinging at me. Nah, I'm gonna need you to hoop a little harder than this. That was kind of hooping. That was a lot easier Professor, than I expected for tough and difficulty, but we are at the this tutorial still, good. I'm guessing. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Ah, that's where they're leading me. Revelio. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Lumos. Seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. This man, LeBron got 14 already. Go, Bron. Oh, I had to do it from here. I'm like, what? I gotta get used to that, okay. 
Alright, where, where Professor go though? I mean, I already killed all of them, so like, you telling me this? Oh. He kinda hooping, I ain't gonna lie. He kinda hooping. He kinda hooping. I ain't gonna lie. Fucking a nigga from the back with no loot. Fucking nigga what from the back the with no loot. What in the fuck? Now they said there was no black hairstyles. I'm curious, I'm a look up Harry Potter porn. Oh my god. Alright. Lumos. We gotta find this man. How do I find him though? Okay. Okay. They're leading me somewhere. Are we even looking for this nigga at this point? Floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Did he pocket that bitch? to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. what you're seeing the glow that surrounded them yes sir astonishing can I see magic traces of an ancient magic to be precise the magic that Miriam had always believed existed but could never Miriam and perhaps George died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. 
And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We won't all look rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. Man, this little ass bitch ass nigga ain't finna do no shit to me. Fuck. Oh. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. <coughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you did terrible. I have no patience for traitors. Now... Where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Oh, he uses hands? He don't even have a wand. Beating that nigga ass, low key. I know my out. <laughs> oh. Oh. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? Need break that bridge, shit. <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Port Key Games. That's an interesting little prologue, I can't lie. Oh, good. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, 
I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? That's kind of lit, I can't lie. Yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. The sorting ceremony is over. There were complications. Complications? It seems the goblin Enough. problem has. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig, and I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> okay, so Call headmaster and dickhead, okay. <laughs> Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain, certain expectations. Expectations. I'm looking forward to exploring Hogwarts and the world beyond the castle and grounds. Hmm. Indeed. Much can be gleaned by having an adventurous spirit. But your professors have a great deal to teach you as well. Mm. I wonder. Mm. I detect something in you. A certain sense of. Mm. What is it? Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. Mm. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. Hold on, man. Hold on. Ain't Slytherin like evil? Ain't Slytherin like evil? Hold on. Known for cunning ambition and a hunger for power. Isn't ain't ain't, ain't Slytherin kind of like evil? I don't know if I'm evil, man. <laughs> Slytherin might be the right house for me though, cause that's what a snake said. I ain't gonna lie, I fuck with snakes. Not like snakes, you but like. You belong in Slytherin. I don't know, nigga. And one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Bitch ass. Oh, I want the lion one. What's the lion one? It's not as though Ain't that the one Harry Potter was in? Together. Damn, but I trolled. Don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you all have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Damn, nigga, you just met us, nigga. 
quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet you. I'm... Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Yeah, she was already finna do that, nigga. Like, damn. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. As Deputy Headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. I don't know if I'm fuck. I don't know if I'm fucking with that though. I fuck with snakes, but I don't know about that one. It's a bit much. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. Game smooth, though. I ain't gonna lie. Can't lie, I didn't really, you know what I'm saying? But hey, it's looking straight. Niggas got better beds than me, shit. Damn. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Okay, so I can just do that shit on the man. I go in other people's rooms? I can? What the f... Now that's crazy. Uh, how much of this can I explore? Oh, so this shit like actually truly open world. It don't actually make you go places. That's hard. Bitch ass nigga. What's good? What's good? Okay, I mean. Boy, that shit just freaked the shit out of me. I suppose some introductions are in order. That means fifth year. Must be different starting Hogwarts in your fifth year. Wonder where they're from. They're lucky they didn't end up as dragons too. Like that poor man from the Oh yeah, I forgot I'm with the I'm with the I'm with the I'm with the bitch ass niggas. So I gotta really, I gotta really show these niggas who I am for real. Okay. Okay, let me introduce myself to the real niggas. That is not helpful. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. Not everyone has a ministry escort to school. He was a friend of Professor Figs, who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? It's all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. I ain't gonna lie. I don't give a fuck with these. It was nice meeting you, Sebastian. I don't give a damn. I'll let I you get really back don't. To your book. Nice meeting you too. Good luck today. I don't. I don't really care. I don't really care. What a bitch is that? Uh, might want to think that again. Okay, here we go. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. 
You should have listened to me. Ah, oh, I know who you are. You're the new Slytherin, the one who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting tactic on your first day, taking all the attention away from the first years. I'm Amelda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days I'll show you a thing or two about flying. I can teach you more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen Wizard Chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does what no one accent is this? Here? Goodbye, Amelda. Nice meeting you. Okay, so they got guided answers and guided questions. You have no choice. Okay, interesting. Lumos. I I think I heard one. You ain't hear shit. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Ah, based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're the new fifth year. I'm Ominous. Ominous Gaunt. Nice to meet you, Ominous. What the fuck well, is he looking at? certainly had a memorable arrival. Is he blind? He gotta be. Nah. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> You're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any help as you navigate your first days here, though I doubt you'll need it. The oh, fuck are that? Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin, one of the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. Ain't gonna lie, he kinda cool, I ain't gonna cap. Did that student say he thought he heard a Was mermaid? Was that Z? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along, though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Thank no, you, Ominous. Not for bro. Very nice to meet you. Pleasure was all mine. Don't Not be a stranger. Well. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. That was you talking to me? Nah, I'm good. I ain't gonna lie. I'm good. Uh, 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 run, nigga. Uh, uh. Damn. I thought I was gonna be done. Damn. It's more steps? Morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts. I've been dreaming of this day. Yes, ma'am. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, joining us as a fifth year, you'll need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls. Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine what type of career you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, we've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. Here you are. What is it? It is a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. 
I shall. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. I need to stop by the other what Yarnig's looking at. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding law. <laughs> what she walking up the steps like that for? Do keep up. Why don't you cast Revelio on that statue and see what Revelio feels like provide? Up. open for more opportunities like that inside and outside of the castle okay opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker your field guide contains a map of the castle open it up and find central hall all right where's central hall this one no okay this has to be central this has to be it Okay. Let's go there. So I'm just leaving her? And here we are. Quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. I'm gonna say, bitch, it's a that whole fountain right now. in front of you. You finna just You'll run over that motherfucker? Like, what's going on? Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. Can you tell me more about the Defense Against the Dark Arts class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in that regard. What will I learn in charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. All He's terribly a useful. Entertaining wizard and a talented teacher. Okay, let me see what this You mentioned Hogsmeade. Is that Professor? me? Hogsmeade is the only all wizarding village in Britain. Never mind. It's home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, enjoy many a butterbeer there with friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your a first butter day. butterbeer. And you have much to learn. Happily, a butter your professors beer. have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. You'll be up to speed in no time. Judging by your adept use of Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. 
He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. I'm sorry, Professor, but I'm afraid that's all there is to it. Hmm. Almost precisely what Professor Fig said. Speak of the devil? Professor Fig! Your ears must have been burning. Oh? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly good boats one piece, and carriages huh? to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. It's a lot of damn explaining, Good man. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. I'm gonna guide. get back to clapping. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll Pause. be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more I don't even know what about I meant those by that. assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today. Before you immersed yourself in studies, did I hear you? Professor got them deep sideburns. Professor Weasley's interrogation regarding our late arrival. I did try to evade her questions, though I feel a little deceptive. That said, I'm fairly certain she suspects that we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. It was right to keep the details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. It may require a bit more flexibility with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. Understood, Professor. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guide's map? Unfold it and have a look. Fuck he putting his hand on his neck like that for, though? The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. Ooh, it's a whole lot of chatting in this damn game. About our mysterious kid. For now, Shit. focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Let's get it going. This nigga is moving. That shit is so unnecessary, but a good ass addition. Make it easy as possible. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, 
Let me see what a bitch is talking about, man. Hold on. Hold on. I think I'm in the right area. Damn cat a damn slut, damn near, ain't it? I might have went to the wrong. These motherfuckers hooping in Ravenclaw. Hold on. That Slytherin motherfucker, you are a damn traitor, ain't it? It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck is that nigga talking about? That raised girl thinks she can fly better than anyone. Alright, we just gonna start it, I guess. Let me see what it's hitting for. Let me see how many points Brian got. an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <clears throat> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of chant. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with the passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Mmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Hmm? Hmm. Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are, and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Damn. Akio. That is not bad. You Ooh. are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Why is she looking at me like that? Well, as you all seem to have the <laughs> basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. That's all, nigga did all that chatting for that? I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree, hmm? <laughs> So, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? 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 Eh?
this nigga is straight moaning like nigga what is that shit you doing simply cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charge at the last possible moment now uh, don't lose your composure that's it excellent control there very good points to Slytherin but there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up. That was like a pregame. Like, that was like the warm-up, though. You'll be the blues just as before. And Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'm him. I'm him. I'm him. The fuck is you talking about? Very good. Let us be this. Oh shit. Oh shit. There we go. Okay, hold on. Bro, I didn't even mean to do that. Hey, bro, I didn't even mean to do that. Watch this. I'm not gonna beat that shit anymore. Yeah. Am I MJ? I alright, bro. Alright, bro. Alright, bro. Alright, bro. Nah, nah, nah. She trolling me. It's trolling me. Nah, it's trolling me. It's trolling me. Now, how you restart? Now, how the hell you restart? Nah, that she trolling me. Now I was supposed, I did was supposed to like, I was trying to hold it, but it wasn't starting until like I let go of X. Hold on, let me look at my gear. Hold on, we got gloves? Come on now. I gotta have it all blacked out for the opiums. Hell no. Hold on, gold rim? We got some, what the, what the hat's looking like? What the hat's looking like? Uh, this nigga looking ass. Now, if it ain't black, I ain't wearing it. I can take that shit off? Hold on, I can take that shit off the whole time? I can take this off? Oh, yeah, I'm stepping. Hold on. Is this shit black? It's dark. Yeah, we chilling. This, this, this is this what we looking like. This what, is what we rocking. This what we rocking. Fit it up, head to toe. Feel me? Let us make this a bit more interesting. Yeah, make it more interesting. <laughs> Get the. F I think we are well past interesting at this point. Get the fuck out of here with this shit. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go. Man, what the fuck? <sighs> that shit wasn't even moving when she did it. Akio. That's it. Come on now. Come on now. That is how it's done. I'm him. I don't want that to be known. I'm him. Like, I'm him. I just, I just want that to be known. If I, I just know I gotta hold it now. That's all that's changed, you know? I don't even have to do anything here, you like, you know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes you gotta understand, some niggas is just him. I don't even need it, I, you know what I'm saying? We'll just stop it right there, it don't even gotta go no further. You know what I'm saying? We don't even need it. 
Like, I'm not even trying to show off and other shit. Like, I'm not even misogynistic or something, but it's just, it's just levels. Like, I'm just helping. Good, both of no? you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Fuck you mean it gets easier? I promise, bitch. I beat. I, I mean, not not bitch. <laughs> I mean, I mean, I beat you. <laughs> Tell you shit. But yeah, uh, I'm glad you understand. I hold my own. Uh, I'll be nice, cause I ain't mean it That's like that. Hear. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot to take in all at once. <clears throat> it's no, it's no reason to go crazy. You know? <clears throat> I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? It addresses mountains of the moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first time I saw it, the mist was so thick I could hardly make out anything at all. And then it just materialized before me this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. This may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. <coughs> I had to speak real quick. <laughs> I do miss what <coughs> I do, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor She's not Anna talking about that. Better not keep him waiting. Not gonna Until lie. next time. Not gonna lie, she not talking about nothing. Of course. I ain't know none of that shit she was saying though. If you would, if you're so inclined. Well, do I really gotta talk to this nigga? Clothing, to be precise, Sebastian. You know it won't work on humans. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom. But a bit mad. What's the blue? I want to see what the blue logo looking like. I'm not gonna lie. It's like a, it's like a bat. Okay. Okay. I'm just, After my brother learned the I'm just trying to jump, suck, check on, suck, suck, check. I'm trying to check on all my, my classmates. Flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. Why this nigga running everywhere? Like, calm down, bro. Calm down. I'm the last nigga in this. Okay. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit 
distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Man, what type of shit is that? Okay. We got another main quest we gotta do. Let me track this. Go ahead, get to it. Wait. Wait. Okay, so it's only this. Why why did it look like that? I like your project. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? That was you talking to me? Hello. You wanted to speak to me. Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. Why is she looking at Hope me like that? Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. I find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. Yeah, go get go study. <laughs> Fuck. That shit was light work. Fuck. What the, what the fuck he, what she what she just say? What what she just say? Charlie, how much longer do you think Black will be headmaster? I have family in America. I wonder if I could transfer to Ilvermore and he would come back when he's gone. I wish the headmaster would retire. Let Professor Weasley take over for him. Good thing. I thought she was, I thought she was saying something about Blacks. She's talking about headmaster Black. Okay. My bad. Oh, it's below me, I'm guessing? I'm, I'm so confused right now. Protego. I'm currently not tracking anything? What do you mean I'm not tracking anything? I'm literally tracking this quest. Alright, let's go. I ain't never getting lost on this game. They know what they doing. All the people that got lost on Elden Ring from getting their ass beat the whole time. I hope y'all happy. This how this how we doing the games now. We not only got a, a waypoint where you can see the map like on GTA, but they now putting that joint on your screen for you. Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity. Especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned. Starting with something small. So I'm dead ass for like, finna like do like, like lessons type shit. That's what we doing. I'm just saying like. 
Levioso. Oh, so you don't actually do that. That's just to learn spells. So that's not a good cop out for why they didn't no, make this multiplayer. Let's try something a little larger. So I'm the new nigga I see. So we just gonna make examples out of me every time, even though I'm special. Let us begin with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Remember, a surprise good. Now, the basic is well done. He got some swag to it. He got some swag to it. Very good, but the best way to practice is by duel. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Bro, this nigga don't want no smoke. Hogwarts, welcome. Now, he don't want no... Bro, I why he talking like that? Using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso. <laughs> lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Oh. I know. <laughs> what are you doing up there? Fuck, you talking about what are you doing up there? What are you doing up there? Let's just say I'm a quick learner. Fuck. Not bad for a beginner. Not bad. You give as good as you get. Not bad. I just bust your ass. Not bad. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to Bron keep practicing got 30. whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. All right. That's enough spectacle for one day. Class, nice work. I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. In fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Exclusive and unsanctioned? Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Actually, it was loud as fuck. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till next time. Alright. That's probably going to be part one. That's an hour and 30, man. Ain't gonna lie. That was kind of lit. That was kind of lit. Could I ain't gonna lie. But I feel like the prologue was the best part. They feel like I feel like I was actually going to school. 
after the prologue, so not too crazy to me after that, but I feel like they just teaching me stuff. I'm still in the tutorial phase. Um, we'll get back to this another day, but yeah, that's going to be it. If you guys want more, like the video, subscribe if you're new. Further ado, your boy Fitz, out of it.